and I'm only bringing this up because I've seen this and I, I've been through this myself where uh, a guy yes guys will specifically like play the game like you'll ask them in the beginning what are you looking for what do you want to what is your end goal in talking to me what are you interested in me do, and guys know they can sit there and say oh I don't I don't know I, I just met you uh, like I only known you for a week I don't really know they do they know they know if they want to take things serious with you they know if they just want to play games with you they know ahead of time just like a girl knows within the first 10 seconds of meeting the guy if she wants to be physical with him period a lot of them like to play dumb but like they know so when I ask you uh, where do you see this going or where where would you like to take this like in the future maybe if somebody just says oh um, I just want to see how things go don't have nobody waste your time like that don't do that because they they don't know what they want and if you're actually interested, I can understand if you if you don't really care, that's fine. But if you're actually interested in them and you want them, you know you know that you want them. And they're they're just like, oh, let me I, I just wanna see see your way out the door. Cause we 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 really don't have time for all that. Like, okay, high school you good but this is for people who are are adults like we're we're at that stage where all the games all the the, 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 the back and forth like that's that's over if you just want to date if you just want to be friends if you just want to you say that up front and a lot of people do they say it up front to the wrong people that still may not understand you know they still may try to like like a friends with benefits type of situation like they may both agree to in the beginning but somebody ends up catching feelings we're not talking about that we're talking about people who deliberately like it's almost like lying because you're, you're you're not telling somebody your true intentions but you're but you're not like you're not lying about it you're, you're just saying like um, well, you are lying, but you're just saying, like, you're not telling the whole truth. <laughs> you're saying, like, oh, I don't really know what I want. I don't really know where this is going. Okay. You can figure it out over there. Like, not right here. Like, I'm not about to do this. I'm not about the second chances either. Like, I'm sorry I don't do those because if you did it to me the first time what's stopping you from doing it the second time <laughs> that's how you that's how cold you have to be in this dating game like it's ridiculous it's ridiculous that's how like calculated you have to be and it's sad because you're supposed to be you know this is not like friendships this is like some people that you want to possibly date like on a romantic level like you shouldn't have to be so calculated and cold when it comes to stuff like this but that's how it is nowadays that's how it really is like guys will purposely do things to make it seem like Go as far as to act like y'all in a relationship, but when you ask them about it, it's like, oh, we didn't make anything official yet. I'm still single. Like, you just bought me jewelry. You took me out to a restaurant. Like, you like you do extra stuff for me, but you don't want a relationship. I don't know. That that's pretty weird to me. 
And I've had that happen a lot. Like, going out of their way, buying me stuff, taking me out, doing all of that. And yet, you don't know if you want a relationship. You just want to waste all your investments and resources and your time, most importantly, your time on somebody that you don't even see yourself in a relationship with. I will never do that. I will never do that ever again. Like, all that is dead. All that is dead. And for anybody that's going through that right now, like, please know your worth. If somebody wants to be with you, they will tell you. Like, this isn't, you know, high school, 17, 18, where, you know, you go back and forth and you don't know like if he likes you and she don't know if she like like we're not talking we're talking about grown dating like grown people will tell you if they like you or not this is 2018 they will tell you or they will show you which is even better like they will show you they want to be with you you don't have to sit here and settle for somebody that's going to reply like every four days or somebody that doesn't even ask you how your day was you really don't have to put up with something like that like you really don't at all you really don't have to do that to yourself it, it's somebody out here for you don't have somebody think that you're ugly or you're not good enough because you are you are good enough anybody who can't see that they obviously just want something that you have or like or they're just jealous and that's how the world works for men and women well I'm off my soapbox I, I just kind of had to get that out because I've seen so many people go through this and it kind of happened to me recently like I was interested in someone which is rare because I, I kind of just focus on my job. Like, I'm a workaholic. So, I was really interested in him. And he ended up contacting me first. So, like, I wanted to, you know, talk to him. But he, he kind of seemed like standoffish. Even though he was the first one to talk to me. And the whole time I'm just thinking, oh my God, does he like me? Am I good enough? I'm low-key stalking his Instagram to find out the type of chicks that he do like because I, I I used to see like the chicks that he liked and like all of them got their ass out all of them half naked doing the most I'm not about all that like I'm really not and even if you know he eventually comes around like I I can't wait on somebody I'm not going to wait on you. If you want me, I'm right here. I'm right here. Like, I'm talking to you. <laughs> I don't, I don't get it. I don't get it. <laughs> but that's how people are nowadays. They, that's how guys really are. I had to ask my ex, like, are guys really, like, that dense? Are they really that dense? And he was like, yeah. Yeah, in real life. So, and this isn't, you know, to all guys, obviously. You know, these are to people that specifically do that. And this message actually applies to men and women, not just, you know, women, you know, men please recognize your worth women recognize your worth like we're not putting up with the foolishness if you're in your 20s and your 30s all those high school games are over it's over we're we're not about to play phone tag and um 
like I don't know if I like you if you don't like somebody move on if you like them talk to them get to know them it's as simple as that but anyways thank you for your time um, hopefully I come out with a, another video later on either either today or next weekend because I, I never have time during the week but thank you for your time see you in the next video